Multiple US media outlets are reporting that a grand jury in New York has voted to indict former President Donald Trump. The New York Times is reporting the indictment has been filed under seal by the Manhattan District Attorney's Office and will likely be announced in the coming days. It's expected to relate to hush money paid to former adult film actor Stormy Daniels in 2016. No former or sitting US president has ever faced criminal charges. Now, we're just about to cross to our North America correspondent, Jade, Jade McMillan. We've actually got her now. Jade, what can you tell us? Well, Joe, this news has only broken in the past hour or so. I think it's come as a surprise to many. There had been a lot of speculation uh, that this indictment might be coming. Donald Trump, uh, in fact, had suggested that it would happen last week. That didn't happen. Uh, and there had been reports that perhaps the grand jury in Manhattan that has been looking into this case wouldn't be considering it for some time to come. But multiple US media outlets are now reporting that this grand jury in New York has voted to indict Donald Trump. We don't know at this stage exactly what charges he is facing. This indictment is under seal uh, and we don't expect that the details will be announced for a few days to come. But Donald Trump's lawyer says that she has been informed that this vote has taken place. Uh, she says she doesn't know at this stage when the former president will surrender. That is a process uh, that is likely to involve Donald Trump coming to court in New York City. Uh, it is a process that is likely to see him uh, have his fingerprints and mugshot taken. He will then appear in court, an initial court appearance known as an arraignment, uh, where we believe he would be expected to enter a plea and more detail should become known then as to exactly what charges we are looking at here. So still a lot of detail uh, yet to come, but this is unprecedented. No sitting or former US president has ever faced criminal charges charges. So uh, we wait to see at this point in time a, a bit more detail as to exactly what Donald Trump is facing. And Jade, what's this likely to be in relation to? Take us in through a bit more detail uh, what the allegations are in relation to Stormy Daniels. Yeah, so the indictment, as I said, is under seal. We don't know exactly what the charges are here, but it has been widely reported that this grand jury in Manhattan has been examining hush money paid to Stormy Daniels, an adult film star, uh, payment that was made in 2016. She alleges that she had sex with Donald Trump while he was married. He denies uh, that allegation and says that he's uh, been the victim of an extortion plot. Uh, but this money was paid by a lawyer acting for Donald Trump. What the grand jury, uh, we believe, has been looking at is whether any New York laws were broken uh, in the process of paying or then accounting for that payment. Uh, Donald Trump's former lawyer uh, did go to prison, was charged uh, over that, but the prosecutors at the time decided not to pursue charges against Donald Trump. Uh, this grand jury, we believe, has now been going back over that payment how it was made, how it was accounted for, how it was recorded. And so we expect to see charges along those lines. But as I said, uh, this is under seal. We don't have those details at this stage.